welcome back to my channel. I'm Jennifer and today on Trading Card Mystery I have some Marvel's Avengers cards. These are from the Age of Ultron movie. So come along and we'll check them out. Now, as we take a closer look at the pack, you can see some of the Avengers there. There's Iron Man, Captain America, Thor, and Hulk. And if we flip this over, you can see that there are over 200 cards to collect in these little packets. And there's eight cards in every packet, which is great. These are by Tops, and there are the differing cards that you can get there. They have different rareness levels. So let's hope we get some rares and I'm going to crack on into pack number one. Okay, I can see Falcon first. <laughs> and first up we have the Falcon. That is a hero card. You can see on the back it says all the logo there. There's four stars in the middle. And next up we have Ant-Man. I really like his suit here. That's a nice card. Nice finish on it. And this is the Stone Savage Brock. I had not heard of that character before. That has three stars and is a hero. Oh, we got a Thor card. This one has an extra sheen to it. That looks cool. So there's five stars under there. And it says Avengers Age of Ultron. And an extra shiny holographic Hulk card. That looks awesome. I really like that one. That one's more rare. I think that's one in three. And we got Hawkeye there. You can see him with his bow. And I think that's Titania. I might be saying that wrong. That is a villain. She just has two stars. She has a nice purple and white get up. And Whiplash is our last card in this pack. So I'm going to open up the second pack now. Now on to pack number two. Now, I have seen Age of Ultron. It was out in the cinema just recently here in Ireland. And overall, I enjoyed the movie. They must have had an absolutely huge budget for it. I did want a little more emotional dialogue with the characters. There was a lot of jokes flying around, maybe a little too many for my liking, but it was a lot of fun and is definitely worth seeing. The movie definitely seemed to be setting up some new heroes for the future, and that's about all I'll say about that. Oh, we got Iron Skull. Look, that's a very, very shiny card there that, of course, is a villain. And next up, we have Wendigo, Wendango. I don't know if I'm saying that right. That is a villain. It looks like he might be facing off against Hawkeye in that card. And we have Thor. That's a pretty cool card. Of course, he is in the movie. Rock Troll, another villain. Oh, a pretty Captain America card. I really like that. That has five stars. That is a hero. And we have a giant man. I like the green background. That looks nice. And this is a duplicate card. We already have that one. And this is Biggle Snipe. I don't know that character. That's a villain. Look at him. He looks like he goes around grunting and stomping. That's funny. So be sure and tell me what your favorite card is so far. And I'm going to open up our pack number three. And also be sure and tell me if you're lucky enough to have seen the movie yet. Or if maybe you're in America and it is out very, very soon. Super Adaptoid. Wow, that looks cool. That is a villain. And next up, we have, it looks like the hammer for Thor. So he's throwing his hammer. That is a weapon card. I didn't know they'd have weapon cards. That's pretty cool. That is, of course, Thor's main weapon. Mighty looking Captain America card. That's one of the official ones from the Age of Ultron. I really like his suit there. Captain is always one of my favorite characters. Whoa, and a holographic Iron Man card. That looks awesome. He is flying. Really like that one. The Abomination, that is a villain card. I really like that one too. Oh, this looks like a card that you can piece together with other cards had you collected them. I'd really like to see all of those together. And we have Thunderball. That is another villain. He looks very old school. And we have Absorbing Man. That is a villain and our last card. 
Now I have lined up some of my favorite cards from all these three packs. They are awesome. I like the sparkly ones. I'd say the flying Iron Man with him reaching out looking like he might use his weapons is one of my favorite cards in this set. Now if you haven't, please go see the movie when it comes out and come back and tell me if you liked it. I uh, definitely did enjoy that. I went to the cinema in Galway and saw that with my husband. It was a good movie overall and I'm excited to see in Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. how that all ties in because I know they're all kind of connected right now and they are playing off of each other. So if you enjoyed this, don't forget to like and subscribe. I do have more videos on the way. I put up new videos every Saturday. Please check out my gaming channel. You can subscribe to that as well. I'll put the links up here for you. And I will see you all next time. Thanks for watching.